Hey guys, this is Teacher Elo and I'm here to explain how to use because and why. Okay, so today we will learn how to use why and two tips for using because correctly. Okay, so what is why? Why is an information question. That means you cannot answer with yes or no. You have to give information. It tells a reason and the reason usually starts with the word because. So this is part of the answer. Because. For example, why do you drink coffee in the morning? So this is a regular question. Your answer I drink coffee in the morning because I need energy. All right, so I need energy is the reason. I don't drink milk, not water, not juice. It's coffee and the reason I need energy. Okay, so this is a traditional answer with because in the middle. So next, are the two tips to use because and the first one don't forget the subject with because this is very important it's a common mistake so here's an example we enjoyed the movie because it was funny all right is that correct i hope you said yes because there's a subject after because. Remember the subject can be a person, a place, or a thing, something like that. The next one, we enjoyed the movie because it was funny. Okay, so is that one correct? I'm sure you saw there's no subject. So this one here is not correct. We cannot say because was funny. We need to say what what was funny. Right? The movie was funny. It was funny. All right, here's another example. Well, two examples. They liked the restaurant because the food was delicious. They liked the restaurant because it was delicious. So which one is correct? Okay, I hope you chose the first one because that one is correct. Because the food was delicious. The food is the subject. The second one, they forgot the subject because was delicious. There's no subject. So that is not a correct sentence. All right, so don't forget to subscribe if you like to learn different classes with me. When you subscribe, you get a video every week. All right, so tip number two, use a comma when you start with because. Okay, this is maybe a little difficult. So there's a lot of questions about using commas with because, right, comma or no comma. So generally, we do not use a comma with because when we have because in the middle. So the examples we just saw had because in the middle, so no comma. It's not necessary usually. But we do need a comma when we start a sentence with because. That means the first word is because. So here is an example. She ate a lot of cake because it was her birthday. This is the more traditional. We have because in the middle. And here's the different style. Because it was her birthday, comma, we ate a lot of cake. So, since we start with because, we need to put a comma after that clause. So there's a comma that's correct. And we see the girl eating all the cake because it was her birthday. Okay, here's another example. Ralph went to the store 
because he needed eggs. Again, this one's more traditional. We have because in the middle. Because he needed eggs, comma, Ralph went to the store. Okay, so again, if you start with because, maybe the reason is more important and you want to start with the reason, just don't forget the comma. Okay, and there, there are the eggs. Okay, so let's do a quick quiz. So like usual, I'll pause the video for about five seconds. You can copy the answers and you have to find the, the mistakes. Okay, so I'm going to read these to you first. Because I walk to school, I am tired. She needs to drink some water because thirsty. The birthday party was fun because we saw many friends. The food is hot. Why my mom took it out of the oven? Alright, so I'll give you five seconds to find the mistakes. Okay, I hope you found the mistakes. Here are the answers. First one, because I walk to school, I am tired. So here I need a comma. Okay, so make sure you put a comma after, after school. Okay, next one. She needs to drink some water because she is thirsty. All right, so she is, is the subject and the verb. So this one forgot the verb too. So make sure you double check that you have pretty much a complete sentence after because. The third one, the birthday party was fun because we saw many friends. That one we don't need a comma. And the last one, the food is hot because my mom took it out of the oven. All right, so before it said why my mom, that's the wrong word. So you just want to be careful when you're explaining or giving a reason that you use the word because. Alright, so I hope you learned something. If you did, make sure you like the video and share it with a friend. And don't forget to subscribe. That means you get a video every week. You can ring the little bell, which means you'll get a notice. Somebody or YouTube will tell you there's a video available. Alright, so thank you for your time.